Hello, this is Coding Money. Our JavaScript training algorithms for beginners would not be complete without the classic FizzBuzz challenge. We need to write a program that console logs the numbers from 1 to n, but for the multiples of 3, print Fizz instead of the number, and for the multiples of 5, print Buzz. For the numbers, which are multiples of both 3 and 5, print fizzbuzz. Here's an example. Uh, I would like you to try this problem and post the video right here. Thank you for trying to solve this problem. I hope you were able to find a solution. If you did not, this doesn't matter. We'll work on it together. Uh, the whole trick to solving this problem is using the modulo operator. If you haven't used that before, we'll use it right away. Okay, of course we need a loop, right? So we'll start from one, I let, let i equals to one because it's given in the directions and the condition that we need to satisfy is i less than or equal to n and then i plus plus. Okay, so the first thing that we would need to do is to check for if the number is a multiple of five and three if it is uh, so how to check if a number is a multiple of uh, three we use the module operator so we can say I uh, the module operator is the person sign um, if I is um, if I modulo three equals to uh, zero it means that if the um, if i is divisible by three completely and it does not have any remainders then it means this number is a multiple of three okay and so i also need to check if i is um, a, a multiple of five if if i is divisible five by five and it does not have any remainders then in that case we need to write phase bus right else if if i is um, multiple of three and if i is divisible by three and it does not have any remainders after the division uh, then it, it means that this is also we use the modulo operator every time if we need to do like for example every third time or every second time in, in a repetition uh, so that's how like i'll show you uh, now in the example okay so in that case if it is um, multiple of three we need to print fizz so console.log is else if i is a multiple of five we need to write buzz console.log else console.log the number i okay let me save this and run the code As you can see, I provided the number five here to the function. And as you can see that I have the number one, two, and then it says fizz, and then I have four, and then it says buzz. Okay, let me try with a bigger number like 20. Okay, let me save it and run the code. As you can see, so like I said, if a number is a multiple of uh, three, then it means then, it means that it will repeat every third time you see this is the third you know every third time we have fizz every fifth time we have buzz and every time that the number is divisible by three and uh, five and there is no remainder to that number like for example 15 we write fizz buzz okay that's the solution to the classic FizzBuzz challenge. I hope you enjoyed this video.